Hello, my name is Sujay Stevdas Sahastra Buddha Shantikari Ram Krishna Bhagwan. Today, I'm going to be showing you how to make a typical Bollywood movie in four simple steps. There are three basic storyline types that most Bollywood movies follow. First scenario, a boy is minding his own business and living his life until he meets an astounding girl and falls in love. Eventually, a family member or a social division keeps them apart. Second scenario, a super skilled agent or action hero is challenged and has to pay off a debt or kill someone to get some money or something like that. The hero just demolishes everything in his path and kills everyone. But he's also very suave and good at dancing and gets the ladies. He's almost like a mix between Superman and Usher. Every single line in the movie is unrealistic, overdone or excessively witty. Like no one talks like that. Revenge is a dish best served with a side of paratha. Third scenario. A boy and a girl are in love and they live their regular lives but then tragedy strikes and everything changes. The couple is split up and consequences will never be the same. The first half of the movie is like a happy little romantic comedy and the second half is just blood, gore, death, revenge, action and coming back to life somehow. Now that you have a storyline, you can choose a main hero. You have three options. You can have the lovable idiot who's either really dumb or really drunk all the time and just stumbles into things and has unrealistically high goals. Hey Bapu, my friend. You see those stars up there? But Karthik, it's daytime. Whatever. I'm going to be one of those stars. I'm going to, uh, I'm going to get a wife. I'm going to have 20 children. And I'm going to be the best male fashion model in the western half of Hyderabad in Andhra Pradesh, India. Oh, such a big goal, man. You could have the selfish rich brat who left his family in India to go to the US or the UK. Hey, what are you doing, beta? Putting your, uh, your profile on those Indian dating websites? For your information, Dad, it's called Facebook. And I bet you don't even know what a MacBook Pro is. What do you say? I don't need you. Who do you think you are? I got like a billion dollars and so many white women. And you're just from a little village in India. What do you know, man? I'm modern. But son, you have a lot to learn about love and the respect. Then there's the super suave superhero guy we talked about who doesn't care about anything and just kills everyone in his path, gets money, gets women. Good for him. Every Bollywood movie requires at least 10 music videos. But sir, isn't that too many music videos? <coughs> you shut your filthy mouth! Now as I was saying, music videos are an integral part of Bollywood movies. So it's always very important to make it flashy and shoot on a nice location. If you can't afford to shoot at a nice location, just green screen it. I'm sure no one will notice. You might also want to make your song modern, hip and very much new sounding. The best way to let all the kids on the street know that your movie is the cool is by putting a good gangster rap part into it. But of course, you won't be able to get a real rapper. Instead, you'll just have to get a poser Indian with an American accent. Uh-huh. We end it. Yeah, let's go. Pyare, pyare, dil se, dil se, merry baby, zindagi hai, yeah. And now finally, we have to make some dramatic dialogue. Because no Bollywood movie is complete without random, over-the-top, unrealistic, cheesy lines. Oh, hello there. I see you, uh, enjoy the reading books. So do I. Books are like a pathway into my mind, into my soul, into my stomach, and into my love. When I see you, my heart, it does the tug buck, tug buck, tug buck. So charming. And occasionally, you'll need some white people in your movie, if it's set in the US or the UK. You know what'll make them perfect for the movie? If they somehow speak in Hindi. Danke, Dushman, Kohamisha, Ya Bat, Yad, Rakni, Chahiye, Ke Dun, Kabhi, Kush, Nahi, Butla. Ah, excellent. Yeah. 